Neutral Cure Silicone. After you apply the silicone, set it aside and let it cure. Step 3. Removing the mud flop. A quick note, turning the wheel full lock to the right will give you more room to work in the wheel arch. Next, remove and retain all the screws that secure the right hand mud flop. After removing the screws, now it's time to remove and retain the mud flop. Step 4. Removing the foam pad. Here's a quick view of the foam pad from inside. To remove the foam pad, underneath the guard, unclick the plastic lock. Just discard the foam pad after you remove it. Step 5. Cutting the template. Cut out the outer guard template and carefully align it with the top and rear outer edges of the right hand guard. Ensure that the template follows the contour of the guard. holes to 13th mil.
Step 9. Using a 98mm holster. Note, when you're drilling the saw, make sure to lubricate the serrated corner of the saw. Now, it's time to remove the tin plate and the tape. Step 10. Apply an anti-rust paint. Ensure and apply the paint on all opening edges. Step 11. Using a 10mm drill bit. Viewing through the hole in the outer guard, you will see a pre-existing oval hole in the inner guard. Through this oval hole, drill a 10mm hole in the second inner guard panel. a lactite thread lock before screwing the stud inside. Make sure to align the hole and start wrenching it to tighten the stud. Step 16. Drill a hole for the snorkel bracket. How to mark the position of a snorkel bracket. Temporarily place the snorkel in position on the outer guard. Using the bracket as a template, mark the two hole position on the A pillar. Then remove the snorkel body and start drilling. Drill a 3mm pilot hole. Step 17. Use an 8mm drill bit. Just a quick note, 
drill only the 8 mil hole through the outer skin. A quick spray of anti-rust and wipe and clean the surface area. Step 18. Vacuum and apply a silicone. Ensure to vacuum all the debris to avoid rust. Then apply anti-rust paint. Next is to apply the silicone to seal the hole. Step 19. Insert the nylon plugs into the 8 mil holes. Use a rubber mallet to firmly snug the nylon plugs. Step 20. Installing the snorkel bracket. Just align the bracket holes to the nylon plugs. Then use a screwdriver to tighten it. Step 21. Installing the airbox. Before installing the airbox, run a bead of silicone around the airbox adapter. And then, refit the airbox base into position, feeding the foam gasket into the snorkel intermediate tube. And then, screw back the airbox into position. Reconnect the harness connector to the airflow sensor. Next, we fit the air filter element and air box lid. Step 22. Apply a silicone to the outer guard. Step 23. Fit the snorkel body. Fit the snorkel body to the guard by locating the short tube section at the bottom of the snorkel inside the intermediate tube. Then, tighten the snorkel by using the nuts. And lastly, fit the snorkel bracket. Step 24. Position the air rum on the snorkel body. Fit the air rum on the snorkel body so that the two lowered screw securing the mesh are horizontal. Secure with a black coast clamp supply. And lastly, we fit the inner guard and the mad flop. If you find this video useful, please hit like and subscribe. Thank you for watching.